let me show you how to check the voltages at the terminal block. Disconnect the dryer from the wall outlet and keep it disconnected until I ask you to connect it back on. Go behind the dryer and remove the terminal block cover plate. Connect the dryer to the wall outlet. To minimize the chances of an electrical shock, please make sure that no part of your body touches the dryer while the dryer is connected to the wall outlet. Set your multimeter to read higher than 240 AC volts. It is very important that you know how to use your multimeter to read AC volts. If you don't know how to use it, read the instructions that came with the multimeter before proceeding. Take a reading between the two outside terminals on the terminal block like this. The reading should be close to 240 AC volts. If the reading is below 200 AC volts, the problem could be on the fuse or circuit breaker box, the wall outlet or the power cord. Take a reading between these two terminals. And take another reading between these other two terminals. Those two readings should be about 120 AC volts each. If any of those two readings is less than 90 AC volts, the problem could be on the fuse or circuit breaker box, the wall outlet, or the power cord. If the voltages are okay, then the problem is in the dryer and you need to check the door switch next.